now from WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. Well, that's one thing most folks are going to be happy about. Finally, some cooler numbers getting closer to normal by Wednesday. Uh, 83 degrees for tomorrow, then back into the upper 80s and then the 90s make that return. We are tracking some rain opportunities. I don't think either of these days are going to be complete washouts. It's just going to be certain parts of the day that you're going to be prepared for some of those passing showers. Tomorrow's rain is going to be very spotty at best, and I don't expect it to be too impacting. The day is going to start off dry, but we have this front that's going to push to the south of us and stall out. And as it stalls out, it's going to keep that instability around. So I'm expecting lots of cloud cover and maybe even some earlier sprinkles through the day. But as we head into the afternoon, that's when some of that moisture is going to filter in roughly three, four, Four o'clock. I do expect some showers to move through the area. It to be very nuisance in nature, uh, so not going to be too impacting to your day. But I want you to be prepared for it in case you have to turn that windshield wiper on that first level. As we head into the evening, we'll start to lose the raindrops. So starting off the morning, uh, very warm, but not as hot as it was this morning. Low 70s into the mid 70s by the 9 o'clock hour. Noticing tomorrow we're not going to be focusing on heat index because these numbers are so close together. That means while it is still going to be a bit muggy out there, it's not going to be oppressive like some of the numbers we saw this weekend. So temperatures getting into the lower 80s as we head into the afternoon, and that's as good as it gets. Now, I do expect some of those spotty showers to be around through the evening. So anybody that's going to check out ZZ Top, uh, they're doing their raw whiskey tour starts at eight o'clock. Those spotty showers are going to be around. I don't think it's worth canceling. If you have tickets, I think you should go. Just be prepared. Have that umbrella on standby. Our better opportunity for widespread showers and storms arrives on Wednesday. Level one out of five for strong storms. The morning's going to be pretty quiet, mostly to partly cloudy. Temperatures are going to warm as we head into the afternoon, and then we're going to see some of that moisture build in from the west. Those showers and thunderstorms roughly starting to push in at around the five o'clock hour. We'll be tracking that through the evening, and as we lose the sun, those storms will lose their intensity and we'll see some drying and some clearing just in time for the start of your Thursday where we're looking at partly cloudy skies. Temperatures that are going to be warming into the upper 80s through the afternoon, hitting 90 degrees where a stray sprinkle is going to be possible south of the city. Another opportunity for afternoon showers and thunderstorms on Friday and then we're drying out just in time for your Saturday. If I had to make plans for the weekend, I think Saturday is the best time to do that as temperatures are going to be pretty comfortable and I'm expecting dry conditions. Some showers are going to be trickling into the area on Sunday. I expect that to remain south of Baltimore. Baltimore, and then we're all dry on Monday where daytime highs are going to be in the mid to upper 80s.